Samsung just made a quantum phone that we've only seen in movies. You guys remember that scene from Avengers Age of Ultron where Ultron was in freedom searching for information of nuclear weapons and all that thing. But there was a Jarvis that was protecting the information from Ultron. He's fixated on the missiles, but the codes are constantly being changed. By whom? Party's unknown. We have an ally? Ultron's got an enemy. That's not the same thing. Well, Samsung is doing the same thing in their next quantum smartphone. The first quantum 5G phone is official now, which is from Samsung called Galaxy A Quantum. You might heard of a quantum computers before. They are really expensive and very powerful as well. And one of the abilities of these quantum computers is that they can generate unparalleled series of numbers to create the best possible security, which is almost impossible to crack or hack. So Galaxy A Quantum has something that we have not seen on any smartphones before and that is the Quantum RNG chip. This chip will generate truly unpredictable series of numbers which leads to unbreakable security keys and making the Galaxy A Quantum one of the most secure smartphone ever. The way it works is that it uses an LED source of light to generate photons. Then a CMOS sensor detects the photons. The number of photons detected within a certain sensor area for a certain time is unpredictable according to the laws of physics and there's your random number generator. The Samsung LCA Quantum is not just a gimmick, it's built specially in collaboration with SK Telecom. This phone supports several services which utilize Qualcomm security like user identification, mobile payment and more. SK Telecom plans to expand related ecosystems so that quantum security can be applied to more services in the future. Now the phone itself is the Galaxy A71 5G. It's similar to the Eurasian A71 by rocking a 5G modem combined with Exynos 980. At the moment, the Galaxy Quantum is available for pre-order in Korea from May 15th to May 21, with official sales starting from May 22nd. The asking price is around $529, and there is no information on possible international release yet. But the Galaxy Quantum is a very refreshing move and a very important step bringing quantum computing technology to consumers' devices. Right now, there is no way it will make its debut in the Galaxy Note 20, but hopefully with the Galaxy S21, we could see this quantum technology inside a commercial Galaxy flagship smartphone. So yeah, this is all. I know it's a very small video, but I really like how Samsung is innovating, so I thought it would be interesting to share it with you guys. So yeah, that's all in this video. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. It would be really appreciated. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one.